If Super Tuesday were a movie, Democratic strategist Abu Amara says he'd call it the moderate strikes back. That was an anomaly. I don't think anybody saw that coming. I think it speaks to kind of two dynamics. The first is uh, Senator Amy Klobuchar is one of the most powerful uh, and liked uh, Democrats in the country, and that's especially true in Minnesota. And so when she asked the people of Minnesota to vote for Joe Biden, uh, they followed her lead. It was a blockbuster night for Biden. He won 10 states. Biden entered Super Tuesday with one primary win under his belt, South Carolina. That victory was thanks in part to black voter support. It happened again, this time a strong showing from black elders. Just confirmed what was always true, which is the black vote is key to winning the Democratic nomination. Biden doesn't have the nomination, but picked up a great deal of delegates. Senator Bernie Sanders won four states. If you take a look, whether it be in Tennessee, in Alabama, in Texas, the fact of the matter is Joe Biden beat Bernie Sanders by 40 points with African-American voters. The idea that somehow Elizabeth Warren, who did worse with black voters than Bernie, was the cause of his failures, I don't think is uh, fair to Elizabeth Warren. Amor says if you can't win black voters, you don't have a path to the nomination. Just the math. Uh, in the South, which African-Americans make up between 25 and 50 percent of the voters, um, that base has been critical for any nominee. You can't win without the South in the Democratic primary. It makes up roughly uh, 350 to 500 delegates. You need the South, you need African-American voters because that's a large base of people that you can't ignore. It appears President Trump isn't ignoring blacks either, recently rolling out this platform. Think of this, blacks for Trump, black voices for Trump. African Americans for Trump, call it whatever the hell you want, right? A change of tune after publicly thanking black voters for not showing up in 2016. And frankly, if they had any doubt, they didn't vote. And that was almost as good because a lot of people didn't show up. He understands the power of the black vote, the exit polls tell us. If he can just get 13, 14, 15 percent of black voters, that might be enough to stop a Democratic nominee from winning the presidency.